So look guys welcome back to the channel in this video we'll cover this lab so first of all click on start lab and open the console incognito window now here basically the first thing is that you have to just activate the cloud shell so before that just click on i understand and then we have to just click on agree and continue if you get any kind of pop-up like this so that's why i'm showing it and then we have to just activate our cloud shell so let me show you how you have to activate the cloud shell Click on the button next to the Gemini. It will take some time, so just wait for it. And here, basically, you have to just click on continue and authorize yourself. So just do it as soon as possible. And if you're new to this channel, do like the video and subscribe the channel. Just authorize yourself. now first let me increase the font size because many of the participants are using mobile phone to complete the labs so first i will increase the font size and in the description box of this video i have shared one repository we will be using it to just export it okay so first i am increasing the font size now come to the lab instruction and from the github repo you have to just select it like this come over here and just paste it now here we have to export some values the first thing is, is container name so how to find the container name come to the lab instruction come over here to the task number one just here you can see container name product underscore inspection it might be different for you so copy carefully you can use your notepad and make sure there is no any extra space now paste over here and hit enter now we have to export the file name so two file names we have to export first is defective and another is non-defective so here you can see defective product json the highlighted part it will be different for you so you have to just select it like this and again make sure there is no any extra space or mistake now again do the similar with the non-defective part so just copy carefully and just paste over here and hit enter now just wait for these commands to execute and once it's done, we'll be done with the lab, guys. And for other lab free courses and skill badges, you can check the description box of this video. Now, finally, it is done. Now, let's move to the lab instruction and check the score. And finally, we are done with the lab. If you want to enable this, check my progress bar. You can check the description box of this video and if you are unable to see the score just particularly visit the particular task or you can do one thing refresh the browser window and that's how we complete this particular lab.